Scissor siblings, come see me this weekend in St. Petersburg, Florida with Stevie doing a special Scissor Bros Live. And we're doing some stand-up on the spots there. Stand-up on the spot is also hitting the road in Huntington Beach, California, Los Angeles, California, and more. Tacoma, Washington, and Oxnard, California, I'll be headlining there. And remember, new episodes of Stand Up On The Spot every other Monday at youtube.com slash at standupots. There's a new one dropping this Monday, actually. And also get tickets and new merch at jeremiahwatkins.com. Got some awesome stuff in. Thanks for the support. My dad, he had this saying, we all make mistakes. Mm -hmm. And he was a hardworking guy. Like, I'm really kind of relating to your story. Yeah. I didn't have a wallet. My dad was in the uh, circumcision game. He... uh, (laughs) Got something right here. Uh, yeah, little, yeah, yeah, little, yeah. Little fuzz. Yeah, yeah little Thanks fuzz. Yeah, up, no problem, no problem. Wow. Yeah, we were just talking about about my apartment, and um, he asked me how big it was. He Sounds asked like me, a winner. Like how how many feet? Like twelve by. It's like three hundred and fifty square feet. The good so. news about small apartments like that, it's mm. like when you commit a crime, and you will, when you make the transition to to prison, Alcatraz or Rikers. <laughs> It's just going to feel like home. There you go. You're good. I'm Smart good. Smart play. If you thought about committing a crime, Steve, what would it be? Uh, mm. Probably just like grand theft or something like that. Oh, wow. Or grand. maybe like graffiti or something. Something not that major. Grand theft seems a bit... Yeah. Um, it seems a bit like... I don't know. I feel like you need to wear a robe, like a velvet robe. This is a grand theft. It's very ornate. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. And you just steal a car, you you hijack, you carjack someone, but you've got a like a, a velvet robe on. Yeah. And right. Maybe even a crown, because it's yeah. grand. Yeah. Excuse me, I will be taking your Kia today. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Would thou please donate us thy Prius, you mofo? Or whatever. I don't know Hands what the British in the say. Air, biatch. Yeah. <laughs> Reach for the sky, Velveeta cheese twelve. Or whatever they say. I'm not in a gang. I don't know. I think you have the vernacular down pretty well already. Yeah, I've had the vernacular down all right. <laughs> Holy fuck. At the Motel 6 in Bakersfield. Oh, wow. Yeah. What goes down there? The vernacular. Yeah. So like, yeah. <laughs> when was the last time you went down on a vernacular? Oh, God. I think it was uh, Bakersfield. A lot going on in Bakersfield. Yeah, why, why Bakersfield? Why, what's going on in Bakersfield? It's just, it's easier up there. It is really? Yeah, you just, you, you know, you got the grape farmers, you got the onion farmers are out mm-hmm. in the fields, and they're already crying because they're around the onions. Are the Koreans up there too, or just... Well, uh, 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 there used to be. <laughs> what, what, do you, what do you mean by that? Well, there's a river, they built an aqueduct. And then that's what they, they, they threw One the Koreans they in there? they all fell in, and now they're down in South L.A., yeah. And so they got washed down to They're the right south side. Marina Del Rey. Really? Yeah. So the Chinese people too? Uh, those ones never got up there. Yeah, the Koreans didn't, didn't like mingling. Okay. Yeah. I mean, that is true. Yeah, that, that is, right? That's kind of true. That's kind of true. Look at your history books, guy. Yeah, Korea yeah, yeah. And, and China never Yeah, you well. know your stuff, Harlan, you do. Like, when was the last time you saw a Chinese restaurant beside a Korean restaurant? You don't see it. You don't. Never. See, never, ever, 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 ever. Never. Right? So, that's interesting. Wow. So that's called the patty cake, patty cake, baker's man theory. Yeah. <laughs> um, Would you, well, if, if you are laugh. you married? No, are you? If you weren't married and you had to choose from a Chinese woman opposed to a Korean woman, which one would you choose? A Korean woman or a Chinese woman? Oh, I was going to say an albino Dutch, but I'll go. And they don't tell you ahead of time which is which. Okay. So it's a potpourri. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Okay. For between Korean and Chinese, yeah. huh? Wow. I'll throw in a curveball. Oh, Japanese. Chinese, Korean, or Japanese. I think I might go Japanese. Oh, really? Yeah. Okay. Because okay. I've been to China. Yeah. I've been to Japan. Yeah. I've been to Korea, too. But I found the Japanese women to be just very gentle mm. and manly polite. And, yeah. and polite mm-hmm. and mysterious and sexy Mm -hmm. and all the things the others aren't okay let me throw in another curveball so thai (laughs) chinese 
Korean,、uh, Japanese. So I'm throwing. You have the other option is a Thai, Thai? Wo- Thai woman. Ooh, I always like the Thai woman, so I'd go with that. Yeah, you would. Wouldn't yeah, you? is it is the exotic factor come into play? It's just they don't move much. When you tie them, they're just you can get away with. Well, if you're gonna do Bazooka Joe impressions, I might have to go to Seven Eleven buy some bubble gum and chew it for half an hour, then stick it to your boarding school ass cheeks. I mean, I'm not messing around here, guy. I'll bubble. I'll double bubble you like a Dolly Parton whorehouse rolling down Conway Twitty Boulevard, guy. And I'm not even joking. I know you're not. <laughs> Guys, back on the podcast、yeah. today,、oh. returning guest. He is. Yeah.、Uh, uh, he is the host of the Harlan Highway、oh、podcast. Oh my god, he's、right. the best. He、Number、is one. one of our favorite guests and yours. <sighs> one, one of our favorite comedians and yours. One、yeah. of our Favorite television and movie stars of yours. Please welcome the great Harland Williams to the yeah, show, ladies、yeah. and gentlemen. Thank you. That's but too kind, too、Thank、nice. You, buddy. I gotta say, you、yeah. were a favorite on、uh, when you did stand up on the spot recently too. Yeah, there was. People、yeah. loved you online. Oh yeah. Oh, they did. Oh, oh they, that、yeah. was fun. Yeah, I never.、Yeah. I didn't know what to expect. I'd never. I'd never done that before. Yeah. And、uh, man, yeah, it was it was fun. That was a that was interesting. And then you came up at the end. Yeah, we、mm-hmm. had a riff together.、Mm-hmm. Me and Waddy went at it, and、yeah. holy、oh, smokeramas! Yeah. Oh he's yeah, a pro, he's a pro. Yeah, it's it's weird when you do that. It, it's a、uh, it's it's just like because you said no, no new material, right? Yeah, you have yeah, to yeah, do、no、it、material. like、mm-hmm. completely raw. Yeah,、mm-hmm. raw, raw, off the cuff, on the spot.、Mm-hmm. Yeah, and it yeah. was uh, it was uh, I enjoyed that. It was stimulating. I, I I didn't know what to expect. Like you really got me this time. I didn't know what was what, who was who. Some of the people, some of them smelled. It was weird. What did they smell like? Like, give it, give us some adjectives of description. And it can't be one of the Asians that he just named no, earlier. No, 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 a, no. You don't have to honky, do the Asian thing. There was a honky there that smelled like onion butter. I don't know if you've ever had <laughs> onion butter, but they serve that at Cracker Barrel. I. I'm a big Cracker Barrel guy. I've never Aren't you? There. Yeah, I've never you've、gone. never gone. I was close to going in Pittsburgh, but、oh. uh, it's a white people staple. I know. Yeah. What's good、yeah. about it? What's good about that place? What 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 dishes do they got? It's comfort food. Mm-hmm. But don't sit near the front the the front window. Why is that? G- g- like sit deep because that it's like you get a crap ton of food for free. Yeah. And have you ever seen like a bird fly against a window, like a pigeon or a hummingbird? You're just sitting in your living room, splat. Yeah. Well, I don't know what they decided on a corporate. I'm not behind the scenes at Cracker Barrel, but、um, I guess when they offered abundant amounts of food, like huge amounts of food at ridiculously low prices, and you put it in sort of rural areas where people don't necessarily watch their diets,、uh, I've a couple of times I sat right at the window and a fatty just smashed right through the plate glass, like. <laughs> Well, I need to laugh at my misfortune, but what kind of what sorry? Kind of, so what kind of food do they serve well, there? Is well, it let's, soup let's or what on, is let's it? Let's stay on the fatty for a yeah, second. I, <laughs> I would like to stay on the fatty okay, for a second. Okay. Okay.、So, They bust it through the glass. <sighs> well, I wouldn't call it bust. I mean, like I said, you ever see a bird? I mean, they just ram it. Like、right. you, you see your bacon and eggs start to jiggle,、mm-hmm. and you're like, "What the hell?" Like the Jurassic look- Park scene where the water of, starts、yeah. shaking. Yeah, 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 Jurassic yeah, yeah. Park, you got a water, but you ever seen a Western omelet jump up and down? Like、no. it has Parkinson's. It's almost like a Parkinson's omelet. I've never seen an omelet with Parkinson's. You、before. will get to、uh, <laughs> Cracker Barrel or Crack, as I call it. And yet these fatties, they just they they park their trucks, they park their mans. I I saw one where they rolled up the back of a U-Haul, and eight of them came storming out. It was like a pack of velociraptors, and they just smashed through that glass. And holy God, crushed the table, scrambled eggs everywhere. Oh my!、God. Did they pay for their meals? It's a smash and grab. Did drive-by <laughs> guys pay for the hospital bill? No. I'm just saying for your safety, I like you guys. Just、yeah. don't sit in the by the window. Yeah, okay, go that's deep. fine. Yeah, go like go at、deep. least two rows back. Now, Is you, it a buffet or what's the deal with no, it? No, that's a table、yeah. service. There's waitresses,、oh. and sometimes、oh. the waitresses are、oh. a bit chunky. They'll you you'll、oh. turn around. Would you like some lemonade? Oh yes, and then you turn back, and one of your slices of French toast are gone, <laughs> and you turn back, and they're like, 
you know, they're chewing. <laughs> I mean, Jesus Christ. It's Wow, it's like that cutthroat. Oh, oh no. The food is taken very seriously, wow. Cracker Barrel. Yeah. yeah. So they got omelets and French toast. Meatloaf, and, Cajun yeah. catfish. Got, you like Cajun there, boy? Oh, they got Cajun, like oh, gumbo. Yeah. We love they, Cajun. We they love the, the Cajun. We love that Cajun. The gumbo. Black yeah. and Cajun catfish, mm-hmm. child. Mm-hmm. 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 We got ourselves an authentic Korean man Ooh. over here. Oh, daddy gonna come in and hear your prayers at night and lay a catfish fillet on your forehead and pretend you have a temperature, child. <laughs> Please don't stop to me like that. I mean, what, you, we making no, you uncomfortable, a boy? Bit, a you know, bit. like the Cajun boy, we put some black and catfish on your mm. abdomen and pretend you have a freeze-dried cesarean scar, child. We ran out of lube. We use I can't believe with not butter slipping right in on a Tuesday in the mm-hmm. afternoon. What well, he said that right. Okay. Guys, oh, you, you sipping on it, that rebel? Sometimes I, I wish I was the can. Yeah, the receiving right. end. You want to mm. violate me like that? You can, I guess. I don't know. You've never been to Cracker Barrel? No, I haven't. Wow, sort of sad. I know it's kind of sad, isn't it? Yeah. You think I'd like it? I should. I should take him at some point. Is it better than I Denny's? I wish you would. It's like, better like, than Denny's? Oh my! I'm mean, sorry, I didn't mean oh to offend my, you guys. It's Whoa. leagues above Denny's. Oh, what about yeah. Waffle House? Is it like I'm, I'm guessing it's like leagues above Waffle House? In the same yeah. league as Waffle House? It's no, no, yeah. leagues above. Okay. Yeah. What are the prices? What's the price range? That's what the, the thing. Prices? Frugal Bros prices. It's not crazy expensive for a combo plate: eggs, bacon, and hash browns. Like it's five dollars. Four yeah. ninety nine. Wow. Four ninety nine okay, with I'm, I'm the sold. extra side. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah. You can spend. Like twelve bucks there and get a ton of food. Really? Yeah. Get yeah. your stay crackle barrel. They, they, the Harlan went there recently and they threw really? in that jacket. Yeah. yeah. Really? You they got, got that a great cracker gift bar- shop, right? They do. You can buy jackets. I got a really? John Deere uh, vibrator. I got a salt and pepper shaker. Well, you have a John Deere vibrator. Yeah, they sell all kinds of John Deere like paraffin. <laughs> what do you use that for, though? You don't use it on your... To vibrate. Hello. I know, but... <laughs> Every day at 2 o'clock, you come to my house, I ain't answering the doorbell. <laughs> Daddy's in his bed, spread eagle, and John Deere's plowing the field. I would really? l- like it if you had it rigged at your place where every time he you hit the doorbell from somebody, it, yeah. the vibrator went off. Oh, uh, wait, why are yeah. you putting it down there? Well, where are you going to put it? In I have the... a dog. I have massaged my dog with it. <laughs> God. What the with the vibrator? He loves it. Do it on yeah. Gerald real quick. Oh, oh you. Well, yeah, by yeah, the way, wait, wait, Harlan, don't hit him. But you don't had, hit him. You had an incident, him. a couple incidents with Gerald last time. He was he, pretty upset. How many times you hit him? Are you guys yeah. on good terms again? I got no beef with Gerald. I mean, I just said, told you to demonstrate the vibrator John Deere thing on his back or something. Yeah, I can. I can. I mean, you, you, you know, I don't have one, but let yeah. me let me use this pen as a. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's kind of like. You know, the, the animals love nice. stimuli. I don't know if you mm-hmm. ever heard that word. I don't oh, know getting, if they throw that one around kind of up at the You're getting ride. kind of low down the back there yeah. for a second there. Oh. Mm-hmm. Sometimes you vibrate their fucking eye, eye off. Very good. Hey. Hey, oh, hey, 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 stop, 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 He was looking at me. He gave me the fucking six-foot draft fucking side eye. Please, Harlan, Please. don't do that to Gerald. I have glass eyes, you dumb bitch. Well, someone gives me the stink eye, they're going to get it. Okay. Ooh, okay, that was, I shouldn't have brought that up. Yeah, I yeah, was yeah. asking for that. that. Was... So we might have to bring him to the emergency room. He's, yeah, he, poked he his seems eye pretty, pretty upset bad. Right now. Are you going to say some amends to him, the to our friend there? Amen. Darwin? Oh, so that's how it's going to be. There, set amends. Okay, just please don't violate him like that again. Well. Uh, he's, a li- he's a living creature, so. I like how he lo- he pretends he's staring up at the air ducts or whatever's in this house. He's nervous mold. around you, man. Huh? He's nervous around you, that's all. Well, yeah. You just, know, sometimes you just have a knee-jerk reaction. Yeah, People that's fine. look at you the wrong way. Yeah. You know? Yeah. You ever been in a mall, for example, Wadi, and punched a boy? <laughs> if they get out of hand... Right? Yeah. You've done that before? Well, sure. if, if, it's, if it's not your kid, you're yeah. allowed to do it. Yeah. You're I, sti- I can't do it to my kids. Not at your kid, but right. you're at the mall, you're at the food court, you're standing by Orange Julius, and there's like an eight-year-old giving you the side eye. Bang. Mm-hmm. Punch him good. Punch him hard. 
Don't do it to Gerald, though. Now, have you ever had a uh, a side chick before? Have you ever had a side chick before, Harlan? Oh, yeah. What has. do you mean? So, basically, uh, it's like when uh, you have, uh, you're seeing one girl. Oh, yeah. But then you, you got one on the side as well. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I have. Mm -hmm. We'd yeah. like to hear about it. Yeah, how, how old were you when, when you had your last side chick? This was probably in my mid-30s. Mm -hmm. And it's funny, you um, mentioned earlier, you know, Picking a Chinese girl or a Thai girl or, or a Korean or Japanese. Korean or Japanese. Mm -hmm. uh, this girl was Siamese. And uh, I was dating her and her twin sister, uh, Car <laughs> Carol. Uh, she was always on the side. And, well. Wow. No, I'm listening. I'm listening. You're gonna ask questions. No, 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 no. no, no. We're actually, we're actually keep fascinated. Keep we're actually with fascinated. Keep going with well, you it. did ask me if I ever yeah. had a side girl, right? Yes. Yeah. Yes. yes. Okay. So I'm dating this fucking Siamese twin. Wow. Carol and uh, Dana might not appreciate the the chuckling. We don't. We're not trying to offend no. Dana or Carol. Okay. Please continue yeah. with the story. Okay. So I dated uh, Dana, and uh, Carol was always at her side. Mm -hmm. I, well, whether we were swimming, uh, Christmas caroling, mm -hmm. uh, coitus. So what do you do in that situation when you are pleasuring one? Because if you're dating, you said you're dating Dana. Right. Carol's always on the side. Does Carol get jealous? Does she want to hop in? It's or? hard to get privacy. What you have to do is you have to duct tape their face. So you don't want... <laughs> Okay, look, if you guys are good, how about one of these? No, 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 what? He's, he's trying to escape the, no! Oh! Oh. If you Jared, put it in front of me, no! fuck off. No one looks at me like that when I'm talking oh about the Siamese God, no twins. Oh, my God, no one's ever done that, Harlan, on well, the history of Scissor Bros. I'm, try, I'm talking about... Oh, my look. God, he, he, dude, he has a concussion. I'm Harlan, here. Harlan, why did you take it that far, man? I'm talking you about... You knocked him out, bro. You asked me about... I know, but he didn't do nothing to you to provoke well, that he, you response. saw him lean in. You, you did a whole uppercut on him, man. I think you clearly man. saw him lean in on me. He oh, stepped up on the dude, kid. Dude, hold up. No, dude, I trust him. He won't do that. Are we you sure? Him over here? I don't know. It's, there's a lot. We should give him Usually another Usually we, we, we separate him Terrence chance. and Gerald because he did we don't want Gerald Let's to... ask him how he's feeling about being near him. Well, Gerald... Let's, hold up. Let's, we're going to ask him. Are you okay with going back over there with Harland? That piece of shit has cheap shot at me two times in a row. If he does it one more time, I'm coming for his ass. Just, okay, okay, we'll give, I'll give you we'll another give, chance. We'll give it a shot. Wait oh, a minute, guy. I'll give I another chance. Are you sure? Yeah, yeah. Okay. I think if we rewind the tape, you'll clearly see no, he, he stepped up on me. No, he never made a move on you, man. He made that, a move. That wasn't self-defense, man. You provoked that. I. It's you, okay. We forgive hey, you. We love you. But please don't do that to our draft again, man. I say we rewind you know, the tape and you'll see him make a move. You, he you, stepped in on no, me. You, no, you did an uppercut to his his. his well, that's his when he nose. stepped up. He didn't step up, man. You'll see. He watch leaned the tape. forward. He didn't step up. He leaned a little bit towards you. That's, that's all he did. That's a step up. Man. When you're from the streets, the way I am, I guy, know, but he didn't do that, man. He leaned in, okay, and okay. I saw that fucking chin, and it was there. And I'm not gonna let. I'm, Dude, he's okay. I, I think well, the only thing that we can do right now to solve yeah. the situation, we need to do some scissors. Let's just do some scissors. We need to do some scissors. We need to clear the air. Yeah, don't. Dude, don't make don't clench your fist. Uh, you have man. to open you're up your, your you have to open bro. up your hand. It's it's Don't tense. do that. Tense. Wow. Did you see that? Yeah. Okay. Dude, he's Harlan, clinching his fist. Dude. If you remember, okay. we raise our hands raise our and hands. we cross Just them. Peace. Cross them. Do a peace. Do, let's and do we a, count let's out do loud. Some peace, peace some scissors. Peace scissors? Yeah. Okay. Some peace and love some scissors. Some peace scissors. Right. Here we go. Yeah. Ready? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Eight, oh, the Spock's in nine, nine and ten, ten eleven, twelve, twelve thirteen. Thir thirteen. Oh. Dude, he's oh. coming on me. He's so oh. he, you saw him. Dude, he stepped up. Stop Fucker him. stepped you up. Him. Dude, player don't. wants to play. Daddy's gonna party. Oh. I mean, he, I gave him a Cajun fucking blackfish right up the fucking corn cob. He stepped up like a whore at a fucking cancer survival party and he got the fucking pie Dude, he's even though down. he ordered the he's fucking he's not out he's unconscious now don't step up player <laughs> oh 
speckled brown furred player uh, why don't you you're like the waffle of the animal kingdom look at your little sh- fucking divots player <laughs> He'd be so cruel okay. to a giraffe, he ste- man. You saw him step out. Can we, you, if we man. could rewind the tape. I love we'll animals. We'll rewind it. He didn't do anything I to you. I love animals. Yeah, I'm but an you animal just called him a waffle, bro- a waffle something. He looks like a waffle okay. laying there. Can, he may can not we, look like a waffle standing up, dude, but when you lay him down, he looks like a waffle. No, can we let him take a nap for a little bit? He better. And then later on, we're going to put him back up there, okay? Because wow. it's kind of empty. It's kind of empty wow. there without I knew him. when you started clinching your fists, man, something was Dude, up with you, man. You I know, was you sitting st- here I, That's talking. the first time I guess is clinch his fists like that, man. You look like Balboa there. Like, I was sitting here talking about duct taping the Siamese twins' face oh, so man. I could have sex with the other Siamese twin. <sighs> and players stepped up and daddy did the dragonfly. Okay. And when daddy okay. does dragonfly, so, lily pad lay down in swamp. <sighs> Do you want to yeah, wow. play something? I don't know why I'm getting yeah, the grief right. on this subway ride. Want to try to find something? Yeah, maybe. Okay. When a giraffe takes a nap, it goes into another plane. When a Harlan sits down, he looks at you While he runs a train with his fist on one of your best friends The best sleep you can get is a giraffe nap A giraffe nap (laughs) Harlan won't take no crap And therefore, that's why there's a giraffe nap. Watch yourself on the Harland Highway. Daddy gonna land a dragonfly punch. (laughs) Daddy don't take no crap. That's why Gerald takes a waffle-shaped draft nap. Little draft nap. Tender draft nap. The tender giraffe nap. Tender giraffe nap. Whore. Okay, you don't have to call him a... We're trying to cleanse the palate and you still call him a whore you know as I he's not unconscious. Well, well when someone's I spreading give another their chance. legs Let me put him me. up, dude. Let me, let, me, uh, let me talk to Gerald real quick and I, I trust that he won't, he won't do that again. Look, I I'm sorry we got off on the wrong no, foot, that's fine, but that's you got a easy guy. He's yeah. not looking at you anymore. Just, okay. yeah, just just pretend he's not there. As long as he doesn't step out. He's not going to yeah, step he, out. He Twice he did. He didn't step out at all. Are you, how long have you been, been yeah, into what, cactus coolers? Yeah, Because I, cooler. I, don't, I don't know many people who that drink, that. Uh, drink it uh, just without food or anything. They're just like, you're, you're going straight for it. Well, then you probably don't know a lot of people who like to party. Give us a little history uh, with the Cactus Cooler. When did you first have Cactus Cooler? Yeah. So I was in a bike gang when I was in my early 30s. Mm-hmm. I was in a bike gang out in Arizona. We were called the Midnight Runners. My mom's out there in Gilbert. Pardon you? My mom's in Gilbert, Arizona. Are you serious? Yeah. Oh, my God. My sister's in Grape. <laughs> Gilbert Grape? Wait. What in the name of Tanzanian <sighs> foot rub sauce? But I was in a in a bike gang, and yeah. that's a rough yeah. life. Yeah, that's a rough life, and uh, I broke away from that. And did st- you find that the camaraderie was good though while you were in it? Yeah, yeah. I mean, these guys are like your brothers, and that's why I learned to fight. Also, by the way, and that's why I'm a little testy. You know, when you're in a bike gang, when someone steps up on you, you're wearing your colors, you got your boys, mm-hmm. and when someone steps up, when someone fronts, when someone postures. Uh, when you've been in a bike gang, you just can't sit down, especially when you're vulnerable Mm -hmm. and someone leans in. Mm -hmm. Uh, it's like, boom, (sighs) ask questions later, player. What's the name of the bike gang? It was the, uh, Radish Rumblers. And we, we were out in farm country or one of those farm gangs. Mm. (laughs) Radish Rumblers. Uh Uh-oh. 
Okay, no, no, I'm continue. So, I mean, he's, just, not to, he's not I'm, trying I'm to. He's not trying to provoke you. you. It's just, it's kind of a funny name for a, well, a, for a biker to, gang, man. Tell that to Daryl, the oh, leader. Okay. All right. Yeah. All right. I don't want to say that to his face. I don't want to press his buttons. But um, life is good. I've moved on, and now I'm I'm trying to be more positive in life. Mm -hmm. um, I started a charity. I have a beautiful charity. And I don't know if I'm allowed to talk no, about please it. please do. We'd love for you We'd to. We'd love for you to. So I have this charity called Cinnamon Angels Far, Far Away. Fly, Fly Away. Sorry, Cinnamon Angels Fly, Fly Away. I've and actually heard about this. Mm -hmm. It's for children that have cinnamon allergies. Mm -hmm. And uh, we donate all the money to them. And we're doing this fabulous program this year uh, called Velociraptors on Ice. And, uh, you know, kids kids, and people all around love uh, dinosaurs. I think we can all agree to that. My son loves them. Mm -hmm. Right? And mm -hmm. dinosaurs and people love ice shows. Mm -hmm. And so there's a sect of society that gets underutilized, I believe. And that's our seniors. One day we're all going to be old. And so what we've done over at Cinnamon Angels Fly Fly Away, and I'll tell you after this where you can send your money, just to, just to my Venmo, but I'll give you the address. How it works is we, we kind of scout the senior centers around the country, and for Velociraptors on Ice, we find the wheelchairers, and we find the ones with kind of the, what we call level nine uh, arthritis, uh, crippling arthritis, to the point where these elders, the men and the women, their their fingers are so clawed up. I mean, you could throw them in a room with a pumpkin and they'd skin it in about 30 seconds. I, mean, I, mean, I don't mean to laugh. Dude, please don't laugh at that. But uh, <laughs> what happens is we, uh, we get the oldies, we recruit them, and they've got these claws. You can't even bend them. They're so stiff. You can jump on. We've had, we've had trial runs where we've actually stood on their fingers and you flat and they just pop right back out. They don't out. budge. Yeah. So what we do, we get them on their wheelchairs and we put them on the ice. We take them to a, we take them to. <laughs> That's just a funny visual. We take them to a skating arena. Okay. And people pay $40 a ticket. And what's wonderful about oldies, a lot of them, when they get into their 80s and 90s, they have trouble verbalizing. And when you put them in a wheelchair and their claws are out and they start, you start pushing them around the ice, like, they can't really speak. They, wow. Trying to help people. And, So mean. Oh, we're trying Wait, to raise. So mean the way you describe. We're trying to help <laughs> cinnamon children. We're God. trying to help cinnamon children. <laughs> Dude, he's, he's comparing him to dinosaur. Well, Velociraptors. it's Velocira Velociraptors on oh, ice, man. and when you push them, they they they. <laughs> so a lot of them <laughs> they, they can't they scream. <laughs> And picture them sliding around and the children are going nuts. Oh. Some of the children will take their shirts off and throw them on the ice. Wow, so, like it's an 80s rock concert? It's it's like Def Leppard on a bag of uh, diarrhea pills. I mean, it just, you <laughs> see that they slide around and they're, they're, they're the noises they make. Have you ever auditioned? Have I? Yeah. Well, no, I don't need to. I, I'm organizing it. Oh, I, I, I run. You're the director. I, I run Cinnamon Angels Fly Fly Away, and so we we get these old people who are sitting in the seniors' homes doing nothing, staring at the walls. Yeah. And now picture them swirling around, dozens of them, forty at a time. And they have a paying yeah. gig. They got a paying gig. Well, the money goes to charity to Cinnamon Angels Fly Fly Away. I just send it to my Venmo, and then I distribute it from there. And then the, these these oldies are just sliding around, and it's almost like a court. It's like that scene where the, oh, we, we get remember it. Remember when the Velociraptors yeah. were chasing the kids in Jurassic Park, yeah. jumping over lo just yeah. ah! no, Harlan, no, Harlan. We, we have a few strokies in there. I don't want to be mean, but oh, dude, some, don't call some them of the ones. Oh, dude, God. don't don't call them strokies, Some dude. of the ones with the strokes. Dude. And they don't get a that. little Arlen. bit of respect. I, Arlen, we get it. We get it. All right. We get what you're doing. Don't say wow. strokies, we get man. Your guy can't do a charity anymore. Well, how do they donate? 
Just, just send they, it straight to my Venmo. But and what's then your Venmo then? Just Harland, Harland Williams, and then we I distribute it later in the year, like well, towards the end of the year. Th- for tax purposes. Hundreds of thousands of dollars to the cinnamon children that the okay. Okay. kids with cinnamon allergies, now, their have ankles you, puff up. Have you ever done the cinnamon challenge where you put... Uh, like a spoonful of cinnamon in your mouth and then it becomes like a cloud. I don't mess around with it. Mm. I don't oh. mess The horrors I've seen at the cinnamon hospital in Cleveland, I will not... Keep okay, going. wow. No, but there is... Keep going, keep going. With yeah, there's having fun on a podcast and then there's talking about a charity. Okay, yeah, yeah. yeah. And uh, guys, okay. this, if you could walk down the hallways... And see the cinnamon children, their legs in stirrups, their ankles puffed out like watermelons, their lips flapping like vulvas in the night, uh, their eyes like the Hubble telescope just looked down Dolly Parton's cleavage. It's these children, did hair you, plugs uh, on their clits. Did you, it's unbelievable. Did, did you see uh, Dolly Parton recently come back out for that halftime oh, yeah. performance yeah. for the She's Dallas gay? Cowboys? She's still around, huh? No, no, she came out and performed. Oh, you just said she came out. Right. She, she, sorry, she performed at a halftime show. Straight or gay? Straight. Okay. Mm -hmm. So she came out straight, which Mm -hmm. is sort of a oxymoron. Yeah. How do you come out straight? Well, so if everyone thinks you're gay, you could come out straight. Straight. But what so if, you're if Steve straight? was like, <laughs> dude, dude, don't do that. Oh, right here we go. Yeah, do Whoa. We do it every week. Don't do it this week. Come on. Oh. Just don't do it this week. Don't do it this week. Give, spare me this week. Spare me this week. Ouch. Carl Arlen's here. Hey, don't guy, I get it. All right, buddy. Not you're this week. You're safe, right, safe with me. You're safe okay. with me, guy. I'm, okay. So my you're lips on my are side. sealed. You're on my side. My lips are sealed. Thank and look you. at this. My legs are closed. Thank you. Thank you, guys. Thank you. Appreciate it. Thank you. means a lot. Okay. So anyways, thank you for letting me plug uh, Velociraptors mm-hmm. on Ice. I hope everyone gets out. To do, we're doing a nationwide uh, run of it at so all your local. Do you, now, do you, uh, do you collect the old people from different old people's homes yeah. in the different states that you go to? Okay. We have recruiters. We have our talent team. It's sort of mm-hmm. like American Idol. We set up a little thing down in the cafeteria, and mm-hmm. the, they roll the oldies in. And basically what we do is we roll them at a wall, and the ones that can get the claws up enough to stop themselves they're 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 our winners they're the keepers but the ones that go through the drywall they're not going to work because ice is slippery and we don't want accidents so (laughs) (laughs) and that we we kind of picked them on the level of their scream their their raptor sure so it's fun it's a fun process we even had paula abdul coming do a little bit of judging oh. for us. Real, oh, from American Idol. From American Idol, because she's wow. not doing that anymore. Yeah. So we grabbed her, and she yeah. uh, helped us audition the oldies for uh, Velociraptors on Ice. For What's the criteria you... like, then? The louder they are, like, how do you choose who's the best one? Well, it's almost, have you ever been in an all-boys choir at an all-boys boarding school? Uh, I guess so, yeah. Right? Yeah. Well, it's kind of like that. You want different ranges. You want octaves. You want bass. You want treble. Mm-hmm. So you want right. your you want your uh, an, your 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 um, immature Velociraptor. You mm-hmm. want your and you want your bass cuff. Your you know you want you want all the levels so that at the end you've almost got this harmonious velapta yeah. choir. A cacophony, if you will. Yeah. A pardon what now? A cacophony, if you will. No thanks. I'm straight. So you mentioned Paula Abdul. Are you a Lakers fan? Because uh, the Lakers, she was one of the original Lakers oh, cheerleaders. She was, I don't know. Right? Yes, yeah, she was. That's yeah. right. That's right. That girl could dance. Oh, yeah. yeah. Oh, in the eighties, cold-hearted She's snake. A cold-hearted mm. snake. Mm-hmm. I'll never forget. I was at the video shoot for that, and she was. Um, she did. I think fourteen wardrobe changes for that one really yeah. and some of the dances it was funny if you watch the end of the video they couldn't figure out a dance move for right at the end and i was there and i'm like you know what why not help you know i mm-hmm. could sit here and watch them struggle and so what they did at the end if you watch her do it it's in about the last 12 seconds she does a norwegian pinwheel right across the the dance floor just 
twirls around. <laughs> Unbelievable. Yeah, the, and I gave them that. That's so cool. Isn't that wild? Yeah, that's cool. Yeah. What exactly move is that? Is it like a ballerina move? It's like something? a pinwheel. It's like you, you roll along on your hands, yeah. almost like a flapjack or whatever it's oh, called. Oh, it's like a somersault or something. Yeah, it's like a cartwheel it, kind of thing. Cartwheel, yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. Cartwheel. It's, it's cartwheel. Norwegian style. Yeah. Oh, so yeah. closer to the ground maybe. like Closer to the ground. And as I said to at Paula, closer to the heart. Oh, yeah. Mm. yeah. You know, mm -hmm. you got to keep these uh, demented dancers motivated. But I'd say more than my dance moves helped her get through the video was her very own oxycot, and I think that's what helped her really, you know, bounce around and jump. But right. I tried to do what I could. Yeah, sometimes uh, all you can do is support, and then uh, when Look, there's the not support, there's and oxycot the rest, and fill sure. in. Yeah, just powerful dance drug. Yeah, all the dancers. Now, did you ever used to go to raves or anything oh, like I that? Because you getting turned because up, yeah. um, you know, there's a. A few different like kinds of dance parties yeah. out there that you can go to. There's, there's the jungle, raves. There's jung the jungle room. The jungle room. There's, oh. there's, a, a, there's acid disco. House, the yeah, acid, acid house. house. <laughs> yeah. Um, there's uh, what's that one? Um, well, there's acid. Jazz, acid rain. Acid, acid jazz. jazz. Um, um, there's um, what is it? Uh, Filipino Franks. Uh, there's drum and bass. Drum and bass. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, Needles and Schwinn. Have you ever mm -hmm. been to any of these? Let me keep thinking. Are there any more? Yeah. Um, there's um, electro um, break skin beat. Skin and fat. Electro break beat. Uh huh. Electro mm, break beat. Yeah. 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 Um, um, uh, any others you could think yeah, of? Yeah. Bulimia's Adventure. Have you ever been to that one? Oh. I'm still processing. If you could just list a few more. Mm, okay. There's just regular techno, like just yeah. the regular techno beats. Uh, Vag pill. Vag pill beats. Um, um, there's also. Um, Furries and fun. Furries. Have you been to that one? Yeah. Keep furries going. I think you're we're all around it. I think. I feel like. Oh, bootlick. Bootlick, bootlick is bootlick a good bootlick one. Beats. Bootlick beat drums. Yeah. Um, down down the rabbit hole. Down down <sighs> rabbit hole. Berry beats. Yeah. It's almost like I'm in a dream um, and I'm remembering. But keep going if you could just and, list a few uh, more. The um. Li the liquid uh, laser. There's one just called butthole. Butthole. I don't know. Liquid if you've been laser to that one. beats. Butthole I'm beats. A bell. Okay. Um, anal swab. Um, wait, did you say anal swab? Anal swab beats. That one. That's the one. No, I knew we'd hit it. I, right. Thank you. Thank you for your patience. Yeah. Anal swab. Yeah. Yeah. Anal swab. What a riot. I didn't think I'd like the rave scene, and boy, when I got the anal swab, yeah. it was off the hook. Yeah, yeah, we need oh. like that one. Yeah, thank you for. I, I knew we'd get. I, I could. I was. I could feel it, and then bang, bingo, anal swab. Uh, there yeah. was a a time when I got a concussion where I had to go to the hospital. Nice. Uh, what? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Talk to me. Yeah, where uh, I remember being so concussed, and I I saw uh, in the doctor's office, I saw these anal swabs. And the Q-tip, the Q-tip, the, the long yeah, Q-tip, yeah, 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 yeah. And I just and thought they it was swab it. in my it's concussed circular. state. I just thought it was so funny, and I asked the doctor if I could take one with me, and they're like, "Sure, and I you guess." You swabbed it yourself, and I and I I took it, and uh, I went back to the the camp, the summer camp that I was at, where I, where the concussion mm -hmm. happened, and I kept touching people with the anal swab as I was very concussed. Mm -hmm. Wow, like yeah. a, like an anal swab fairy almost. Yeah, like yeah. a. It's wow. circular, circular motions. Yeah, like that. Yeah. yeah. Wow. Those are good days. You ever yeah. been to a camp before? Yes. Yeah. I could see you as a counselor, like a camp counselor type guy. But a cool one. Yeah, cool. Yeah. Yeah. Like, yeah. You know, I went to a camp and uh, I remember some of the camp songs. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, there ain't no flies on us. There ain't no flies on us. Oh, there yeah. might be flies on some of you guys, guys but, but there, there ain't, ain't no, no flies, flies on us. us. I remember that one. Yeah. Uh -huh. And then later in life, I had a friend who worked at Blue Cross Insurance. And it's funny how life goes in full circles. I had a friend who did a temp job at Blue Cross Insurance. And he worked kind of in this office that was just sort of a sea of accountants and accounts receivable people. And he had a little side office, and he said, one day one of the guys came in, big black guy, he said. Mm -hmm. They looked through the window, and the black guy pointed to one of the ladies out in this sea of accountants, and he said, he said to my friend, and this is verbatim, I'm quoting, he goes, 
He goes, you see that lady out there? They call her the fly woman. Because when she opened her leg, there'd be fly coming out. And this is for real. This is like a quote. Dude, you can't say that, man. <laughs> I didn't say you it. I clearly he said, said that, man. He, he said quote. it's somebody else. I know, but <laughs> you can't be saying stuff like that. What do you mean? I didn't Dude, you say can't it. say that there's flux coming out of a Gucci. Let, let him man. cook, bro. All right, let him cook. I didn't say it. This guy did it. Blue Cross Insurance. Uh, I know. No, I got that part. So I'm off. The, look, this. I, I clearly did this. Right, the quotes. Right. Are you doing the yeah. Velociraptor clause again? <laughs> well, let's not poke fun at the Aldis. Okay. I mean, yeah. If you're oh, gonna man. do that, at least make the noise. Now, the uh, the woman that had Fly. the flies, the fly woman. Yeah. Yeah. Did you ever try I, to ask her out? I never saw her. I never. My my friend who worked there just told me this went down. Mm -hmm. I never saw her. I don't know what she looks like. All I know is that that guy said she be the fly woman. Because when she opened a leg, there be fly coming out. And this is a this is a quote. Well, you know, <sighs> you're this close. You're oh, no, this no, close. no, no, okay, no, come no, on, come no, on. no, 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 no,
moment like you had, he said to me, he said, son, we all make mistakes. And if I could share the way your dad had his wallet, my dad, he gave me, I carry it with me everywhere, this mushroom cap. (laughs) Okay, fuck off. Are you fucking kidding me? (laughs) Fuck off, guy. You didn't do it. Fuck, that's my dad. You saw something there. Harlan, we have to pixelate that. We have to to censor that. We can't can't show that on camera, dude. It's a mushroom cat. It's the head of a penis, Harlan. It's been preserved. It's not alive. I I carry this with me every... I go through customs Uh, with this, okay? I... Oh, wow. Oh, Fuck off. Saying. Fuck off. No oh, way. Oh, no. I'll put it away. No, don't yeah, do I, it. I think you need to put it oh. away. I appreciate the sentiment, oh. but we can't show that on oh. camera. You can't oh. show a mushroom cat. No, you can't. <laughs> well, I don't know what kind of podcast you're running, but if I can't talk about my dad and... He's going to make me faint, man. <laughs> wow. He needs to tone it down a little bit, man. He's Unreal. Sort of, he's going to make me faint. Listen. First I get fucking this oh, guy okay. running up. Now I can't Today. share a sentimental story with my dad, who was one of the best in the circumcision game, by the way. Now, now take, a, take a moment. Just take a moment. Now, when you call someone to cir- oh. circumcise, you, you called him a oh. circumciser, but yeah. is it similar to an exorcism oh. where... Uh, you have to call someone to get something out of you. No, no, this is just straight. Where at, he was at La Brea and Melrose for uh-huh. forty-three years. Yeah, we appreciate you leaving a tip. Was on that was on the van. They no, had I, a van that I, went around town. I, I got that. And I, I got to tell you, in so times, <laughs> don't don't, bring don't bring take it back out. out. Look, Please they, don't do it. Oh, so your daddy's wallet's okay, but I can't pull out the mushroom <laughs> cap. My dad made a mistake, and from his mistake, his son learned that sometimes <laughs> things go like wrong. That. Do you ever have a ritual? Because, like, is it lucky, like a rabbit foot at this point? Oh, yeah, like, if you rub it. it, it, it <laughs> I, I rub it for... I rub it for luck. What the fuck's going it's on here? Dead. You know what? No, 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 no. Oh, no. <laughs> Fuck you. That bounced way too much. Oh my god. It's like you've never seen a mushroom cap before. Oh what is with god. you guys? <laughs> that means a lot to me, and you're hitting your laughing? Okay, you know what? Oh my god. You know what? Jesus Harlan. Christ. Wow. Harland, if if you want, I will make amends to your cap and I'll What do you mean? I'll, uh, Steve will give it a little kiss. No, I won't. Are you serious? <laughs> Speak for yourself. Dude, that would mean a hell of a lot. That would mean a lot, my man. Uh, Speak on your own terms. That would mean a lot. That would mean a lot of you could just kiss the tip. (laughs) Kiss the tip of your fucking mushroom cat, man. That's your deal, man. I didn't ask you to bring that, man. That's your decision, man. I carry it with me everywhere. I know, but I didn't agree to this stuff, I take this out at airport security, and I don't have the bullshit I'm having here. Now, if someone wants to kiss it and make this right... Kiss it, man. You kiss it. It's your idea, man. I'll kiss it if you kiss it. Go ahead. Someone better kiss it. Catch the mushroom cap. Oh, I don't know if I can catch this. This, 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 this has been in a pocket. This, this, this has been in so many. Why is it so freaking glossy, man? It's so glossy. What you put? I told you it's preserved. Dude, it's preserved. Dick, it's, it's not a mushroom cap, man. It's, That's a dick. It's been in formaldehyde. Relax. No, it's Kiss it through your shirt I'm if you have to. Okay. <laughs> it's your turn. It's your turn. It's so glossy, Dude, man. Please. I told you it's preserved. 
if it didn't have the chemicals on it, it would be a shriveled. It would look like something you'd see on a pizza. Dude, kiss it. Get it I can't. Over. I can't do it. Get it over with. I can't do it. You did do it through the shirt. I don't do it through your shirt, then. Okay. Here, I'll. Uh, <laughs> don't do that. Please don't do that. Please don't do that. Respect the cap. It's a lot of fuss over okay, a mushroom here, cap. Here. I'll do this, and then you. Easy, fellas. Easy. That's an heirloom. Oh, do. That's an heirloom. <laughs> wow. Here, here, take it back. All right. Oh. <laughs> you got to do it. I did it. I did it. You do it. Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> it was so glossy. Respect to you, though. Respect, man. Now, let me tell you the story <sighs> behind this mushroom. No, I no, 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 Harlan. I don't even want to know the story. All right, with, 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 That's the problem. With respect, with all due respect. I think <laughs> we... your business, man. Wait a minute, guys. Look, I let you tell the story behind your daddy's wallet. We've heard... That's so here we had a truck driver that drove from state to state, okay? Yes, he did some things that violated other people. Glory holes, other people. He went to jail. Who knows where this mushroom cap went? But now it's in my pocket, and it keeps me on course. Wow. Okay, oh. you know what, Harlan? Oh, man. This has been a true ride what on the journey. Harlan Highway for us. And, you know, it's uh, not over yet. We have to not. do the challenge now. Oh, you have Pepsi? <laughs> We're n it's not a Pepsi Coke challenge. Yeah, it's, it's something not a else. Challenge. Yeah. And then Ryan's going to um, describe the challenge. Ryan's going to describe the challenge of what we're going to do this yeah. week. Yeah. Yeah. All right. So today, you guys will be competing in the most frugal oh, of challenges. Okay. The most frugal of challenges, the Steve. The most frugal really? of challenges. Really? Okay. Yeah. So your goal today is to pick up dollar bills and pennies off of a table. It's pretty simple, right? Except you're going to be blindfolded. And amongst the dollar bills and pennies, there will be mouse traps. Each dollar bill is worth one point. Each penny is worth two points. Whoever gets the most points wins... A fifty dollar bill. It's in here somewhere. Yes. Mouse traps. Yep, these little mouse traps. Can they snap your finger off? No. No. There's no way. Fifty dollar bill for whoever gets the most points. You'll be blindfolded. And these are little little mouse traps. They do hurt though, a lot. They do. Yeah. But then again, so does love. This is the Penny Pincher <laughs> Challenge. Okay. okay. Um, Harland, are you are you down to do this with us? I'm, I'm good. I think I, I sense a win. I'm good at this stuff. I don't know why. I just, I've had experience with this. I'm feeling good. Okay. I'm all in. Are we, do, do we take turns? Are no, it's all at the same, same time. There's how, how many pennies and how many dollars? Uh, there are 15 singles. And there's a handful of pennies also. So probably about the same amount. Okay. So yeah, pennies because they're going to be more difficult to pick up are worth two points. Okay. All right, we, we let's do it. Penny pinch right. challenge. Whoever gets the most. Yep. Well, the pennies are worth two points. The, okay. The the singles of dollars are worth one point. Okay. So whoever has the most points wins. And okay. so this one because there's the punishment is kind of in the challenge. There's not an extra punishment, yeah. is there? No, but there's okay. just a prize, fifty bucks. Okay. Oh jeez. Okay. The, the punishment is in the challenge. Okay. okay. All right, let's do it. Okay. Penny Pincher Challenge. All right. I'm getting a little bit nervous because uh, we too. can't, we, like my heart's starting to pick up uh, a little bit because since I don't, obviously, I'm, I don't know. I don't, I don't know how bad it actually hurts. So. It, it's I'm a sting. It's yeah. a little sting. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The key here is to sort of block out the pain. Okay. And like use your use your mental faculties to 
Almost think of it like torture and like you're in a prisoner of war camp. Okay. And you sort of block out any type of pain. Uh, like, it's kind of easy for me. I don't know how it works for you guys. Have you I done this before, Harlan? Huh? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Do you ever see these these old movies? Like, uh, there was an old movie with De Niro and Walken. Oh, Deer Hunter. Deer Hunter. Yeah. They do the, the, mow, uh, mow. Mow, mow. 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 They, they do yeah. like the, uh, the Russian the roulette. Russian roulette. Yeah. So this is sort of my world of Russian. I don't know how. <laughs> Well, this is not like much roulette, well, it man. Well, for me. I got okay, good at okay. it. Okay, okay. Maybe I was a regional champion. I didn't want to say it, oh, but... Oh, man, this is... I'm nervous, too, though, here. I know. No, just hearing him move around. Yeah. So that Harlan's cool as a cucumber. Yeah, I'm fine with it. This is kind of in my wheelhouse. I mean, honestly, I'm just stoked that you're down to do a challenge. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm sort of a little bit bummed that it wasn't something a little more challenging. What? And I'm doing half a quote here, but okay. more challenging. Yeah, okay. I get that. But that's okay. A challenge is a challenge, and, uh, you know, let me know when we're ready. Yeah, I mean, Harlan's Canadian, so this is like, it, this is a Tuesday for him. This is a Tuesday afternoon in a moldy garage for me. <laughs> and this is what we call Mesothemilopia Tuesdays. Is that what? It's cool. Whatever it is. Oh. All right. I'm just chomping it Oof. a bit here. Me too. I'm not wanting to get this. Ooh. The anticipation is almost worse yeah. than the challenge, to be honest. Ooh, yeah. I'm just like, oh my goodness. You don't feel like? Yeah. Okay. Woo. So we have to come up with our own methods not to get hit by the rat traps. I yeah. recommend a little prayer too, like just mm -hmm. clasp your hands together and say, Dear Lord, help me, mm -hmm. help me do this, help me do this painful challenge, help me block out the pain, dear Lord. Okay. Oh, dear Lord, Holy Lamb, Son of the Savior, please let me not get any broken knuckles. Or Can I pray for you guys? Yeah. Okay. Come on. Okay. Hang on, I'm hold on. Okay. Dear Lord, please help these boys. Hang on. Help these boys get through. How the, long? How long's the round? It's well. It's, it's until... in the middle of a prayer. Oh, oh sorry, Harley. Well, dear Lord. <laughs> well, if you could help sorry, these sorry, sorry. boys stop interrupting me and help them get through the rat rat trap maze. Oh, Amen. Okay. Ryan, how are we doing? Set this camera here. Oh. Okay. You know what would be great at this, by the way? And I might incorporate this into Velociraptors on Ice. Oh, no. No, I think the oldies with their claws would might be really good at... Oh, this type of thing. My heart is racing. I can't even feel my heart. Two hearts. Two hearts that beat as one, two, I need you, I need you. I love that sound effect in that song. Two hearts, two hearts. You did it? Yeah. You're the yeah. originator of that the sound effect? Yeah, I used to work at Moog, Moog Synthesizers, and I was the voice sample for that. Uh, I had a cousin who worked at Core. Oh, cool. Right, are you serious? Ready? All right. Okay. All right, are we doing a countdown? We sure are. Ready? Okay. Three, two, one, go. Oh, 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 didn't hurt, didn't hurt, didn't feel it. Ow! Oh, 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 oh. Ow! You gripped me, see? Ah! Ah, oh, fuck! Oh, oh. Quit grabbing me! Ah. Oh, god damn. It hurts. Oh, god! Ah! Ah! Oh. This hurts more. Oh! Ow! 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 Pinky bed. 
bad friends. Ah, <laughs> what is uh, going on? What, is, <laughs> ah, what are you doing? I'm trying to uh, find them. Because you pushed them all to the edge of the table. Wait, oh. what? Oh. Ah, ah, ow, my foot! Ah, ow! Ah, I dropped my foot! Ah, <laughs> ah, 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 ah. Ah. Oh. I think we got him. No! Oh! 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 Oh, frick! Ow! Oh! When you oh! hurt, I hurt. Oh, frick! I'm getting ridiculously hit. <laughs> when you hurt, I hurt. What is going on? <laughs> 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 Yeah. Oh, how many? Is there a lot of money left? There's a fair amount of money left. Ah! It burns. Yeah. Ah! Sizzles. Ah! <laughs> what is going on? <laughs> How many did you set off? About 13, but I'm okay. I'm are, are, the, all right. are the traps done? I think they're done. <laughs> Wait, what? Is... Oh. Wait a minute. Let's put the mushroom cap out and see what happens. <laughs> Wait, oh, no! Ah, you can't put the ah, mushroom! Ah, 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 the mushroom! Yeah. Ryan, how are we doing? Uh, there is still a trap and there is still money. What? Arlen, you have a ton right like near us in between. I know, I pushed them all over to you guys with Why? my arm. With your... So you would get the pain and not me. Dude, I, I one hit my middle finger real bad. One hit your wife. What? I think that's it, guys. Take your masks off. Yeah? All right, we can call it there. Okay. okay. Oh. Oh. I didn't get a damn... I got it, got my, it got my foot. I, dude, my middle finger hurts real oh. bad. Is it broken? No, no. It just hurts. My hand is really sore. Yeah? It just got my foot. Steve I, was pushing him off the table. Oh, I didn't mean to. I was just... Yeah, dude. What do you think was going to happen? Oh. I think I got okay. it. He left that money over there, so... Eight or oh. nine. Okay, so, that, so the money stays. Do you have money in your pocket? My hand was too sore to pick any money up. It hurt so much. <laughs> I did not cheat. I did not. What? Did you use it? Bro, I did not. I did not. Did he use this the whole time? Fuck off. I only saw two hands. I did not use the fuck off. I did not cheat. I am not on roids. Fuck off, you assholes. I did not. Are you calling me a cheater? Count your money. Count, count your money. I couldn't pick any. You, could, you couldn't pick any up? My hand was stiff. I... <laughs> Fuck off! I did... <laughs> this is a technique! I told you I was good at this. This is what he did! I told you I was a champ. Fuck off, I well, did not cheat. Uh, this Count is all I have, I have three pennies and a dollar. Three pennies and a dollar? Yeah. Okay, I've got... Oh. Yeah, Jerry, yeah. Oh my... Whoa, yeah. oh, cheater, wow. cheater. Jeremiah won. She, I think he cheated. Je oh my God, Jeremiah Whoa. won. I think someone cheated. Oh my... Dude, Jeremiah won. I won that one. Yeah. Wow. Should, I, should I get the 50? Yeah, give him the 50. Dude, high five. 50. Yeah. High Dude, five. you see yeah, this? Give him a high five. Give this him a high five. I know. Five. Yeah, you did it. Well, the ultimate frugal bro. The ultimate yeah. frugal bro. Thank you, Harlan, Thank you, for coming oh, on. Thank you. Are, you. You're one. <laughs> Thank you. 
Thank you. You're one of our favorite guests yeah. and our favorite, our favorite of the Scissor oh Siblings. My God. Uh, watch the Harland trip. Highway podcast. Yes. It's so funny. I've been Get on there. Today. Steve's going to be on Steve's there. Steve's coming on. I love on. it. I love Steve's it. I love you, buddy. On. Oh, that was a treat. And uh, is there anything else you want to plug? Go see Harlan live. He's one of the best to do it live. Whoa. Harlan's a man. Thank you. Bless Harlan's you. a man. Tour dates at harlanwilliams.com. Uh, harlanwilliams.com, the Harlan Highway podcast on Ooh. YouTube, and Harlan Ooh. Williams on Instagram. Bless you, Bless for you yeah. have sinned. Hell you yeah. dirty cinnamon sucking freak. <laughs> check Hell out yeah. check out Steve's album, Puerto Turnus. Yeah, and then check out Jeremiah's dates. Yeah, the I'll be on the road. Every mm -hmm. second Tuesday of the month is Stand Up on the Spot mm -hmm. live at the Comedy Store. We love you guys. Goodbye. Goodbye. Scissor Brothers! Uh, hello? Is anyone still there? It's your pal, Gerald, and yeah, it was really nice to see that a couple of my best friends didn't stick up for me at all when I got my ass knocked out. They just uh, brushed past it, left me in the middle of the fucking floor the whole time, but it's all good, you know? I'm coming for Harlan and his ass and his family next. You to see, I might make an appearance on the Harlan Highway, and things might get crazy. I'm sorry, I'll try to keep it positive. Uh, this is a fun episode. Um, watch Harlan Highway and watch the Stevie Weeby show and uh, subscribe to Stand Up On The Spot. I produce that show too. Alright, love you guys. Hope you're well. Have a good week. Bye! Daddy gonna land a dragonfly punch. Daddy don't take no crap. That's why Gerald takes... A waffle shaped draft nap. Little draft nap. Tender draft nap. <laughs>